Blue Eyes White Dragon, Kaibatin. This is pure nostalgia right here. A uh, little side note, note, this is the 2002 Dragon Tin, and this is the 2003 one. You can see the different arts. Uh, this is actually like the original art Blue Eyes White Dragon, but it came in 2003, so this is the 2002 one. We'll get to the 2003 one eventually. As you guys know, they're really, really hard to find, uh, and we also will be accompanying, perfect here, we got a Kaiba 2017 Megaton, I believe. So that's what we're doing for the opening. Hope you guys are excited. Definitely like you guys love the old school openings and everything. Uh, like I said, we have a, we're have trying to work our way through all the 2002, 2003, three tins. We did some Joey tins already. We did some Yugi tins. Uh, so let's get into this. If you guys did not know, this comes with two Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon booster packs, two Metal Raider booster packs, one Magic Ruler booster pack, and one exclusive variant card. So now the, the downside with these older tins is like the promo card, obviously the card on the tin, which is Blue Eyes White Dragon, the, you guys know from now if you watch the other tin openings, basically the card, in, like the back of the card a lot of times gets damaged in these tins because of how they place them. But just look at that awesomeness, dude. 2002, these tins are hard to find because as you guys know, a lot of people actually like Kaiba more than Yugi. I don't know. I love them both. I'll just say Dark Magician was my favorite card back in the day. So we have our two Blue Eyes White Dragon booster packs. We'll set those off to the side. And we do have the other Metal Raiders that came with it. Another Metal Raiders and Magic Ruler. I say this every time, but not Spell Ruler. And then we have our Blue Eyes White Dragon Secret Rare BPT-003. So let's... And this is looking like it's going to be in decent condition because normally you can tell if it was scratching back there. And let's see, this one is in like mint, mint perfect condition, dude. I was setting that tin on the ground nicely. Wow. So out of all the 2002 and 2003 tins, we finally hit on a near mint card, promo card. Let's go and it's the Blue Eyes White Dragon limited edition. Just look at that awesome art. Oops, dropping my sleeves. I'm dropping everything. My gosh. All right. Let's sleeve this bad boy up. Yeah, the back on this one is in perfect condition. I'm really happy about that. Because the Black Skull Dragon and this card are the only ones that were like in really good condition. Well, that's awesome. Like I said, we'll be opening up this after. So for the packs, we're hoping to get, since you guys know it's really random, I don't know, one foil uh, <laughs> would be nice. There is a lot, a big possibility to not get a foil, but we'll do Metal Raiders, Metal, Metal Raiders first, sorry. Tungyo, got a nice long tongue there. Launchers, Launch Spider, we got that guy a bunch. Deep Shark, Deep Sea Shark. Sword of Deep Seated, and we have our rare, which is Little Chimera. As long as this card remains face up on the field, increase the attack of all fire monsters by 500 points and decrease the attack of all water monsters. Castle of the Dark Illusions, Roaring Ocean Snake, Hibikimi, and Kaminari Attack. That guy looks pretty sweet. I like the beard. So, it's just like the nostalgia packs, man. It's so awesome. So, our rare was Little Chimera, along with our blue eyes. Uh, other than that, guys, if this is your first time tuning in the channel, we do a lot of old school openings, and we accompany it a lot with like the new school openings too. A lot of the cards that are like basically the sets that are worth opening a lot of times we'll do for newer school stuff, stuff that we can make our money back on. Because you guys know, once you break a sealed product that is worth a ton, it's very like old school stuff, it's actually most of the time worth more sealed. And I'm having a tough time with the Magic Ruler pack. Okay, there we go. So, Magic Ruler though. Not spell ruler. Well, they're, they're the same. They're like the same thing. It's just like the printing name on it. That's when they changed the magic cards to spell cards. I know a lot of you already know that. It was like copyright issues. So we got High Tide Geogen. That was good in Duel Links when Duel Links first came out. Boar Soldier. That's an awesome card. 2000 attack, 500 defense. This card can only be summoned by Flip Summon. Never mind, that's pretty bad. <laughs> If summoned by normal summon, this card is destroyed. Yeah, that's terrible. Never mind. We take it back. And we have a Flying Camaro 1 as our rare. When this card is sent to the graveyard as well to battle, you can select one win, win monster with attack of 1500 or less from your deck and special summon it to the field and face up attack position. No tribute is required for summons of level 5 or more. The deck is then shuffled. Labyrinth Wall. Nice. We need Shadow Ghoul in here to do like the... Uh, the the gate guardian scene. I forgot what they are. The, the two brothers, man, it's, their name escapes me right now. We got Labyrinth Wall, they use that when Yugi and Joey and all them were trying to walk through the maze, get to the, the brothers that like finish each other's sentences. Ryu, Ryu ran. It was actually a decent card. 
2,600 defense to the 2,200 attack. Not bad. Just, I haven't pulled this card yet, so that's why I like it. I, rem I specifically remember using this card when I was a kid. Flying Khmer number one is our rare, though. It's, like the, it's cool seeing the old school card. I, can, I don't know why. I cannot remember their names right now. Of the Annoying Brothers. <sighs> It'll come back to me eventually. But basically, it's like when um, Black Skull Dragon or Yugi, Yugi fused his summon skull with Red Eyes Dragon to take care of the Gate Guardian. That scene was awesome. We got Gilta the D Knight, Electric Lizard. I know a lot of you probably instantly remember their names. Something Brothers. Dom, Doma, the Angel of Silence, Rainbow Flower, and we have a super rare dice of the world. We were just talking about the Brothers, man. Talking about the Gate Guardian. And we got Kazijin. Kazijin. And Swamp Battle Guard, that's awesome too, because that is a Joey card. Tremendous Fire, Trent. I see Every time I talk about this card, I talk about Golden Sun. It reminds me of the trees in the original ones. And Punishment Eagle. So that was an awesome pack. Could not have called it any better, but increase the attack of this monster by 500 points for every face-up Lava Battle Guard on your side of the field. Then we got Kazijin, the Wind Dude. Reduce the attack of an opponent's monster attacking this card to zero. This effect can only be used once. The card's owner chooses when to activate this effect. Now that would just be called, it can only be used once. While on the field. Kazijin. Awesome super rare. So we got our foil. That's really nice. Now we just need the water guy. I think it's wind, water, and light. I believe that's what they are. Suijin is the water one. I, don't, I forget what the electric guy is. But still, really cool to pull that, especially after we were talking about that. We got our one foil out of here. Nice. Accompanying that with our blue eyes white dragon. Like I said, it was just a perfect timing because we were just talking about Gate Guardian. So we got the Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. The old school of old school packs. Everyone one of these. Karama. Terra, the terrible. Terra the terrible. Dark Gray. Turtle Tiger. And we have a Reaper of the Cards as our rare. This is one of those cards that has like weird attack and defense. Look at this. 1380 attack, 1390 defense. Sorry, I messed up the reading on this. Flip, destroy one trap card on the field. If this card's target is face down, flip it face up. If the card is a trap card, it is destroyed. If not, it is returned to its face down position. The flip card is not activated. Flips, destroys one trap card on the field. So if you, if you, if you target a spell, then it just gets like sent face down again. But still, that's, that's really cool to see like 1380 and 1390 attack. I think they, the reason why they stopped doing that or really didn't mess it up like that much, simply for the fact a lot of little kids play in your game. It's a lot easier to, to, to minus and add and subtract in the hundreds and the fifties than it is to add and subtract thirties and thirties and eighties. Just saying. Hard armor. Kumotu, and we have a car armed ninja. Ray and temperature. Dark treasure. Fire Taru and Subicus the Knight. Or Subicus the Knight. So we got our one foil out of here. We're happy about that. It was a super rare and it was perfect timing what we were talking about. Uh, now we are going to get in to the themed Kaiba Mega 10. So that was actually a decent 10. Uh, I'll say this. I'm just happy we're actually getting a, like a lot of foils from these old school tins. Because I would hate to like, we've had it a couple times I think already where we just pulled all rares. Which is fine because, like you guys know, tins are incredibly rare. And back in the day, out of packs, it was like rare enough. Rare enough to even get like a super rare out of a pack. Like that was even good. So we got our mega packs in there. Send all these tins down. It's the same art of the blue eyes white dragon. As you can see right here. Just a way newer, newer version. And now this is new school. If you guys are don't really know too much about new school, I can do my best to explain. So this is a Mega Tin. A lot of reprint, reprints in here of really good meta cards. What a lot of people need. So we got our Blue Eyes White Dragon. Proxy Dragon, awesome Link card. If you guys don't know what Links are, I think I do have a tutorial video from a long time ago when I opened up like a Link Strike starter deck. Uh, Pot of Desires, one of the best cards in the game right now. Um, it's just like Pot of Greed, but instead you have to banish 10 of your own cards, which actually in today's metagame is not bad. Uh, banish 10 cards from the top of your deck, face down, draw two cards. So it's like the best generic draw two card that we have in the game. Yes, it's a hefty cost to banish 10 of your cards, but a lot of the decks we won right now, um, it can they, they can handle it. 
especially the meta ones. Uh, number 68, Santa Pond, the Sky Prison, and, and Elder Entity Ents. And then we got the Kaiba token as well. So, the, the, I, I'll say this, like, Potted Desires, Proxy Dragon are really good, plus you get our blue eyes, and then our tin blue eyes up there. So we have three Mega Packs in here. Um, the cards that I'm looking for in here are Cosmic Cyclone, uh, Ghost Reaper and Winter Cherries is also in here. So those are some of the ones I'm looking for. I don't want any of the Dark Magician cards, actually, to be completely honest. We have this guy's now banned. Blackwing, Gofu, the Vague Shadow. Crystal, Crystal Ryan, Paris, I don't even know, Parasotal, Magician of Dark Illusion. And we have Dark Magician Circle. Lecter Pendulum, the Draco Overlord, Speed Roid, Pacino Cart, and Summoning Gate. And all the other ones, Paleozoic is there, Paleozoic is there in there. So, we actually, like I said, didn't want to get the Dark Magician cards, and those were the main ones that we got. It's okay. Dark Magician Circle, like Dark Magician's a decent, uh, a decent deck. But for me, what I really need right now is Cosmic Cyclone, and I need one more Ghost Reaper. That's why I'm hoping to pull it here. Because I only have two right now. I know they're in here, so come on, give it to me. Metafoles, silver red. Metafoles are actually metal foes. I, I was always calling them meadow, like meadow foes, but it's metal foes. A little difference, but they're they're a good archetype right now. Perform pal, Gongado. Predaplant, Mori Nephethys. Metafoes fusion, just talking about them. And we have a dark magical circle again. And floodgate trap hole, spirit of the fall wind. So. Just saying, those are probably, if you guys need some Dark Magician, Dark Magical Circles, check out the eBay. Oh, nice, never mind, we forgot a card. Fairy Tale Snow, that's a that's probably the best card we pulled so far out of these Mega Packs. Crazy card, the common is even worth a lot. And then, solid right there. So, Fairy Tale Snow, very, very good card. It works well with the decks that like use the grass is greener, the mill like, Play, like, people are playing like 60 card decks right now and then they open that card and what it does is like basically you use it and you mill cards from your deck to be equal until you have equal amount with your opponent so people who are running 60 card decks pretty much everyone runs like 40 card decks so if they're running 60 card decks they'll use that card mill like 20 cards they can set up their graveyard good with this because you can banish seven of your cards from from anywhere and then special some of this and then it basically is like a book of moon so you can do that as many times as you want per turn it's crazy ancient gear hunting hound Phantom Knights rank up magic launch and we have totally awesome. That's actually a good card, too I'll take totally awesome for that. And We got block dragon speed roid patching go cart So not bad. So honestly We did get the two dark magicians and the metaphors for our secret rares, but for our For our tin We got the Kazi Jin. Awesome because we were just talking about that during that happened blue eyes white dragon in good condition that's what i'm the most happy about it's like a mint perfect condition it's about as best as you're gonna get out of those look at that no scratch marks anywhere or like any sort of wear so that's awesome blue eyes white dragon secret right? just look at that and then also we did get the similar one but you can just tell you can tell when a car is old card is old look at the color difference of newer printings and older printings this one's like more yellowish so awesome and it has the same description too, not a change in that. The legendary dragon is a powerful engine of destruction, virtually invisible. Very few have faced this awesome creature and lived to tell the tale. Awesome. So, then we have our promos. Proxy, Pot of Desires, good ones. Secret Rare, totally awesome, our best one. The other Secret Rares were the two Magician, or Dark Magician, Circle. A few Metaphors Fusion. Fairy Tale Snow is probably our best one. So, um, some of the like, if you guys want some cards, buy some cards, help support the channel, help me buy some uh, awesome product to open for you guys. Check out the eBay; it's in my description as always. Um, and stuff I pulled some of it. If it's not going to the collection or I'm using it, you'll see it listed. So that hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Let me know some other awesome old sets you'd like to see opened. I'll do my best to try and get them. Uh, a, a, a guy who kept recommending Strike and Neos picked up some of those. So that'll be coming soon. But hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys later.